Hello everyone and welcome back to my crafting world. This is Anna. Guys, I have made a mini album using the present die from Scrap Diva Designs and I had so much fun making this because I, you know, I really, really like that die. So this is, and I made it quite some time ago, so I'm not even exactly sure of the measurements anymore. So the spine is two and three quarters and by three so I didn't go all the way up because of the um, because of the design here it would make it kind of awkward looking at least in my opinion so I only did a part of the spine that is the back and I went with um, I decided to go with the red and black with white versus uh, more red or green I, I really like the way that black looks and this paper is from Hobby Lobby. Uh, it is black. All the pages are black and they've got some shiny embossing on there just like that. So I used a few, uh, you know, a, a few pieces of the black. So this is the back. This is the side. And I did not put a closure on it because I, you know, it stands up like a present would. And once, you know, you start putting pictures and whatnot in there, uh, it kind of expands a little bit so I left plenty of space for pictures and whatever it wants to wants to live in there so the front I used her peppermint letters for the ho 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 and I I think I used her flowers as well for the red flowers here this little Santa Claus is a cottage cuts uh, Santa and he's just hugging the little flowers here and the bow in the back and I used some glitter paper and just and some sprays here I added some pearls just to fill in a little bit and make it um, you know give it some more character if you will so that's my little Santa Claus so I open it up and the first page right here so I used these little gloves mittens um, I don't remember where I got them but um, they're in my stash and these little sequin pieces come from they come from buttons galore and they're just the sequin pieces inside their mix and so I put one on each mitten a little flower a little poinsettia almost with another piece of um, greenery that's gold sorry about that and then this is a little pocket and in the pocket I just put a picture mat so you can put a picture either on the front and or the back and that's what it looks like without the picture mat in there and this just goes right back in like that and then on this side, I again used, actually, I don't think these are Scrap Diva. I think these are in my stash. Uh, some more flowers with some leaves, and I used some stickles on there. And this one does not have a mat. You can see the entire front, but it does open up to reveal a small pocket or a small area for pictures. There you go you can put some pictures right or a picture right there one right there and it just closes right back up that way and then the next page I left this page plain because I really I think this this one is my favorite um, so you can put a, a photo there and another one here and I was gonna embellish the little corners but I really like that uh, that look right there and then on the other side we have a couple of more pockets and this one I believe is also a cottage cuts um, die and this one right here and I just made a little garland with the stars on the ends and the little pockets hold some tags from some of the paper that I used and there are the tags you can either journal or you know put some smaller pictures on the back or just tuck in the pictures uh, in the pocket so each one of these have a pocket and uh, again there's a little glue string and again here's a couple of little tags that go inside the pocket 
and aren't those cute oh my goodness those just love that little bow and I try to put all the festive colors in there and then on this side these um, open up just got some twine on there they open up this way and then this way and then so you can put three four four photos in that one and then this one opens up the same way except um, it opens up the same way like that and like that and yeah I thought those were kind of cute and then the little presents here are part of the I believe the Santa Claus on the front I believe anyway so I made the little presents and then a little poinsettia, this little moose, and this deer are also cottage cats. And then on the last page, there, this one, they are also pockets. And this one, I want to say, is also a cottage cuts, the Santa Claus. I could be wrong, but I believe that it is. So... Uh, I believe the little Santa Claus is also cottage cuts and I know for sure this little bear is so these are also pockets and these have a couple of mats in them for photos I did not decorate the back I just decorate or the back one I just decorated the front one and again you can put photos on the back as well and that one just goes right in there and the bottom is not closed off because um, then the pockets would be a little too high if I had closed up the po the uh, the bottom. So I just left it open like that so that the um, the bows would line up. And then this one has a couple of mats in it as well. There you go. And again, the black back is white. And then um, I did not decorate the back of these. And there you go, guys. Really simple. I am excited. I love how it turned out. Love these little guys right here. For the eyes, I did just take a white gel pen and, you know, put a little character in the eyes. And then, you know, I just uh, inked the edges and of the, of the little bear. And that's all I did. I mean, they turn out so cute. They don't need much. And that is my project share for, with, uh, for you guys there we go all right guys thank you so much for watching i will talk to everyone later y'all have a great day thanks a lot guys